Oh, incredibly sad news. Uh, he was such a wonderful, wonderful man, um, held in such high regard by everybody that knew him. Um, not only just in rugby, but you know, in the wider circles throughout New Zealand and, and the world, for for that matter. So, um, yeah, I was very fortunate to spend a lot of time with him early on in my coaching career with the All Blacks. Uh, he, he was a guiding light, really, and um, we shared some great moments and. It's those moments we'll remember now. So, um, just like to say on behalf of you all, Blacks, uh, to Pam and David, Joanne and Sandra, uh, we're sending all our love and prayers. And um, just sorry we can't uh, be there, uh, but know that we're all thinking of you. And uh, obviously, we love the man. Yeah, some you know really sad news, I guess, uh, with the passing of uh, BJ. It's uh, you know he's been a steward of. All Blacks rugby for a very long time, you know, when you can consider he is a, you know, a player, captain, um, and then coach the team to its first World Cup and um, as part of the management as well, this uh, most recent team, I guess, in the last few years. So uh, someone who's given a lot to New Zealand rugby. Um, so it was, uh, it was sad for us to hear that. Um, and we know that, you know, he's obviously been struggling a bit over the last wee while, but our, our thoughts and, and prayers go to Pam and the family and, um, at, at this time, that's all we can do. Oh, as a player, I was just a young kid, and he, you know, he just, he just watched. He, he was in the in the uh, All Blacks through the 60s, and I thought they were the best All Black sides we've ever had, and still do actually. And you know, he was a leader um, and a fantastic ball player and runner with the ball um, way before you know forwards were meant to be able to do that. So. Um, yeah, and and but hard man, but a fair man too. Um, yeah, it's always hard, I guess, when um, you know you lose a, a fellow All Black, and, and I guess in his case, it was, it's it's more than just an All Black. I guess you know he's he's spent his life around around footy and around rugby, and he's given so much to the game. So um, yeah, I was lucky enough to you know spend a few conversations with him over my time here, and um, just a great man, willing to give and. Um, so it's yeah, it's a huge loss for for us, and um, you know our thoughts are with the family. Oh, he's just great. He was good fun. He had a wicked sense of humour, um, but a serious side too. And uh, thankfully, we both uh, shared similar philosophies. And um, you know, he, he was really good in helping me uh, when I first came in. As I said before, like the All Blacks is, can be an overwhelming uh, place, and comes with a lot of pressure and a lot of scrutiny and you know, he, was, he was like a, a guiding light really and uh, a second father figure. So always a pleasure to, to share a, a beer with and he loved to joke, uh, uh, you know, and there's some funny moments we had together so we'll remember those and, and remember him.